Hey guys, what's going on? I have five packages to open today, and I believe they are all some PSA graded cards that I had ordered off eBay. So stick around. Alright, what's up guys? I just wanted to make a quick video going through some of these cards. Uh, it's Super Bowl Sunday morning for me. That means that I'll make some picks and we'll see what happens. So I really want the Bengals and Joe Burrow to get a win. But I think that the Rams win the game. Their strength is their defensive line. The weakness for the Bengals is their offensive line. So I just don't see a way that they can score enough, but I hope Joe Burr can make it happen. He's got ice in his veins. But we'll see. So go Bengals, but I'm picking the Rams by about a touchdown, maybe six. All right, let's open the first package. See what we've got here. They put some cardboard around it on the inside, which I've never seen, but I like it. Alright, I am from Atlanta, so I'm a Braves fan, so you might see some Braves bias coming in every once in a while. But this is Christian Pache. Uh, it's a PSA 9. I got it for like under 10 bucks, like total shipping and everything. Um, I think that he has a good chance to do something coming up here in the next year or so. Um, this is his Bowman first rookie. So yeah, I'm a big Christian Pache fan. We'll see if he can do something. Alright, we got another one here. I have one I'm actually really excited about. I'll show you that one last. Alright, got another one. Let's see, we got this from KC Futures 9 on eBay. Alright, let's see which one this is. Ha, this is an old school one. I guess you're going to see a lot of Braves bias in this one. This is a Chipper Jones, 1991. It's a PSA 9, which is good for them. It's not his major rookie card, but I didn't have one, and I wanted one, and I got this one for super cheap, too. I thought that was pretty cool. All right, let's see what we got next. This big one might not be a card, so we'll open this one. Now it might be. This is not a card. This is my ink 902XL Black. So that's important. Alright, got another one here. Two more guys. It came with a letter. Handwritten. No, they just put it wrapped in paper. You might see all Braves, which is funny because these are the first Braves cards that I've purchased, I believe. This one isn't graded. I don't know how good of condition it is in. I'm about to see. It looked to be good.
an Ian Anderson mosaic prism. And I just think he's a guy that is set to, to have a Hall of Fame type career. He's had a really good first two seasons. And if it looks like it's good, I might get it graded. But this might be a great prelude into what's coming up. I don't typically recommend you buy ungraded cards on eBay since you can't see them, but I got it for like a dollar and then like 250 shipping or something like that. But this might be the one I was looking for. This might be my double rainbow. Here she is. My Ian Anderson Auto PSA 9. These have been selling for around $90, $95. And I was able to get it on eBay auction for, I believe, $62. super excited about this one like I said I think he's gonna have a great career and these cards are only gonna go up I will be talking about some players in probably my next video uh, that I think are already in the league the last video I did was rookies I'm looking at now I think I'm gonna be looking at players who are in the league but whose cards are undervalued and who you can make some money on if that's what you're looking for but yeah that's the guy I've been waiting for Sorry about this light, guys. It's super early in the morning on Sunday, and so it's shining right in my window, which it's usually not. But that's it. Just wanted to show you guys my haul. I got four of them. Three graded, one not. Like I said, don't typically buy cards that aren't graded on eBay, but there they are. Alright guys, go Bengals. Let me know who you guys think are going to win down in the comments. And we'll see you guys later.